All this weekend, Emmy Television takes you inside ACL. Welcome back. You're inside ACL on Emmy Television. I'm Kristen Palmer, and I'm really excited to sit next to Matt Morris right now. How are you doing today, Matt? I'm doing great, Kristen. I'm excited to be sitting next to you, too. Oh, thank you. This is a guy that I've had the pleasure of coming across his music through friends. Charlie Sexton produced your record here in Austin, right? Yes, we, uh, we cut a good bit of the record here uh, at uh, Jim Eno's from Spoon, Jim Eno's studio. And uh, so I got, a, I got some good time in Austin. And he, uh, he's got some great footage. It's, I first came across his music and actually bought two of your songs on iTunes and then came across some beautiful footage of you working with Charlie and Patty Griffin. And how was that working with Patty? Um, I've been a fan of Patty's for a long time. Um, since um, Living with Ghosts, I love that record so much. And um, Charlie said, you know, I think it'd be great to get Patty into the studio to sing some backgrounds. And I kind of lost it. And, and uh, she came in and, and sang harmonies in a song, and uh, it was brilliant. I, I, uh, I had, it was brilliant. That's, that's exactly what I thought. When, um, when I saw the footage, it's actually really well arranged. It's a beautiful orchestra. I, you could call it an orchestra in the background. You've got the strings and all of the percussion. And when you were, did, when you were working with Charlie, did you go into the studio expecting to have the record turn out as it did? Or like, what did you have in mind when you wanted to make this record? Well, um, I tried not to have any expectations about it mm -hmm. and just trust Charlie to do what Charlie did. Um, he pulled together the musicians in Austin. Uh, he, he got Patty to, to come sing on Bloodline. Um, Tosca, the string quartet, uh, Austin-based string quartet who played on the song, he pulled them in. And I found what worked out best with Charlie is just to, like, I, I wrote the songs and then I kind of gave the songs over and, and allowed Charlie to, you know, to, to make them come to life whatever way he thought was best. Mm -hmm. And um, with as little interference from me as possible. So, I mean, I, I, they worked out well that way. Well, it sounds absolutely wonderful. And then with this record, what are you, are you hoping to release it sometime soon? Or you're, you're playing ACL this weekend, and then are you going to go on tour with this record? And, and when do you hope to release it? Well, I mean, there's, there are a lot of plans in the works, and, and, and it's almost, it's a little dizzying because the record release is, is coming up soon. The, the national release will be in January, and, and people who um, go to mattmorris.net before then will find out information about music coming out before January. So, um, uh, I don't know, I, I, I'm just trying to roll with it day by day. Things have been yeah. really, the album's called When Everything Breaks Open, and it's starting to kind of feel like that. Like, every, it's like right on the cusp of this huge change, and, and so I'm just rolling with it. Well, great. Well, mattmorris.net, everyone, and we can catch him on Sunday on the BMI stage. That's right. That's right? Yeah. All right. Well, it was a pleasure. Thank you for having us. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. All right. You're inside ACL on ME.